everyone, and welcome back to yet another political episode. So, we are ha we got some news from Turkey yesterday. Tur President Orgdan has won re-election as Turkey's longtime president. And as we can know, as we know, Orgdan has been very bad in the polls. Um, in fact, uh, his opponent, uh, and I can't... Forgive me, I cannot pronounce his name. It's unpronounceable, but we're going to call him Kamal. Kamal was predicted to win this said election uh, by literally um, five, a lot of points here. So let's take a look at the opinion poll. So take a look at the second round here. Um, we are seeing... We see a, a big favoritism in the first round. We see uh, Kemal literally going, uh, teetering up close to Orgadin in the polls. Okay, that's what the polls are telling us. However, Orgadin prevailed in the first round and showed tons of momentum. So, um, which kind of told us a couple Sundays ago, two Sundays ago, that, okay, uh, this... Uh, isn't going to be a big a win for Kamal um, and the CHP, I believe it's called. Is it the CHP? Yes, it is the CHP. It's not going to be look work, look like a big big win for Kamal and the CHP. Um, second round, Organin starts out big big out strong, but you'll see gradually Kamal then comes up into the polls, and then. On the very last day, you'll see uh, Organin shoots up here, and Organ and Kemal goes down. Uh, I don't know if they do early voting uh, in Turkey. I know we do in the United States, but you'll see here comparing the results to the first round. Hmm. I mean, the first round it doesn't show the results anymore. The first round results are right here. The second round results by. Let's compare, if you will. It's uh, this region and this region. Let me pull up our map of Turkey. Um, our region of Turkey, bordered by Syria, I would think that would go to Kemal because of the Syrian influence there. Because we know Turkey and Syria, not friends at all. They hate each other to the guts. Okay? So, uh, Turkey and Syria, not friends uh, at all. Especially with Turkey's influence in Syria's civil war. Uh, but let's take a look here at that little province slash state here. What it's called. And I don't know my... Turkish states. So that region, Hatay, Hatay, Hatay. I thought it would be like Silesia or something, but that's Hatay. Um, Eleven delegates. Uh, this state originally voted for Kemal. It was, in fact, um, what and the only thing that changed in the runoff was. According to this map, Kate went to uh, Orgadin, and the map gets a little redder, it gets more color, because, duh, all the third parties are out. So, I mean, a little redder as in, yeah, more people are starting to go for the uh, CHP. And the AKP, as I believe it's called, is getting more votes. Um... Yes, the AKP is getting more votes here. So, I am going to see if I can create those results. If you will. Um, and then we're going to take a look at my little video uh, two weeks ago. And see if my prediction was correct. I doubt it was. I had some regions going to uh, Kamal. But I did predict a uh, Organin victory, uh, just because of the momentum, and I was right. Organin did win, and he actually did way better 
than in the said first round. So we have the Yeah, I'm just going to put the colors in. I mean, the names. Organ. And then we have this guy. Kamal. Pillar Karga Glue. I don't know. Yeah. He is popular. I mean, he, de he, he got support in NATO. I mean, the more democracies, the Western powers mainly supported him. He, he got some ever overall support in the United States. So he is popular, but just not in Turkey. I mean, he is popular in Turkey, but he failed to win the election. Um, I He is definitely center, more center than his opponent, Organet. So taking a look at these results... We'll see. This is how the first round went. Uh, we saw these states over here. Make it a little bigger. <laughs> and, you, and, we, and we noticed last time that Oregon sees the delegate vote. Yay, congratulations, Organon. Does that mean you, I mean, not, the, excuse me, not Organon. Kamal sees the delegate vote in the first round. Congratulations, uh, Kamal. Congratulations. Does that this mean you're elected the president? No. Unlike the United States, if you claim the electoral vote or the delegate vote, you are the winner. Turkey does not run like that. Popular vote wins. So if Sure, uh, Mr. Kamal here got the delegate vote, as you will see probably, or am I wrong? He didn't get the delegate vote, because these are the states, I mean, yes, never mind, I forgot about Istanbul. So yeah, you'll see. Look at Organon wins delegate vote. Hooray, congratulations. You win, Kamal. I mean, I keep saying Organon, but it's actually Kamal. Congratulations, Kamal. Or did you actually... Or is it not over yet? It's not over because in Turkey, you need to have at least over 50% of the popular vote to, in order to claim victory. Guess what? Oregon failed to claim the popular vote. So did Kamal, who claimed the delegate vote. So, no, the, this state over here went to Oregon. No, no, no. These are supposed to be yellow. That's their color. So... Yeah, and that one right here. So here's our first round results, all right? Uh, this is not fair. I mean, Kamal does have 335 delegates. He won 30, 335, so he should win. I'm sorry, this is not the United States. So popular vote prevails as um, Oregon wins the popular vote by a couple bit, a little point, about a small amount of points. But however, you're going to see... Um, the second round. So the second round is declared two weeks later. We're going to see the second results. Nothing much changes except for this state. So I think it's halfway. I don't know. Um, I, I, I believe it or not, I already forgotten. So as a result, we are giving this province to Oregon and still Kamal wins the delegate vote but still but it doesn't matter delegates don't matter people do so that is our election results in Turkey Oregon officially winning 276 delegates Kamal winning 324 all right so I'm gonna look up um we're just going to look up, I'm going to go to my channel, and we're going to find my video. Don't mind if you see my sub subscribers. I care less. I don't care if you're subs I'm subscribed to a thing that you don't like. I can care less. All right. Um, all right. 
right. I'm looking for that turkey video. Yes, and also AFO, the AFO USA episode 3 is coming out, as you can see here. Friday, don't miss it. I don't mean to make this a promotion, but for those who are interested in mapping, I encourage you to join in tonight. I mean, not tonight, but a few nights. Friday night for some good conversation and enjoy watching the premiere. So, just putting that out for those who are interested. So, here's my politics playlist. And I'm going to mute myself because I don't like hearing myself on audio. There we go. All right. We're going all the way down to Turkey. I know I've been posting a lot of videos lately. Uh, all right. Here we are. Here it is. The Turkish presidential election. Why am I looking at a video so far long time ago? Well, I just forgot the results of what we voted for. So, yeah, these are the first round results. I know the quality is bad. Um, it usually is at the beginning. I don't know why. I just don't know why. So, I'm trying to think here. Yeah, I felt very unsure about the Turkish presidential election prediction. Um, yeah, we were way wrong um, when it came to predicting. Um, yeah, sure, we predicted an or uh, a win for or um, Oregon, but when it comes to the actual results, this is what we were predicting. What would it look like? We had uh, compared to this, we had. Um, this state over here, go to Kemal. We had this state right here. I mean, I'm just going to call them states because, you know, I'm an American. Uh, right here. And we had this state. And we were, yeah, we were, we were totally wrong. I mean, I was wrong. I'm not blaming on you guys. But, um... Yeah, however, we did get, we did accurately predict this one. We did predict that halfway would go. And that was the case. So, any guys, what, what do you guys think about this? Do you support Ortigan at all? Or do you, were you kind of hoping that Kamal wins? I want to hear from you. I know there's a lot of Kamal supporters out there because no one body likes Ortigan and how he does things. But I can, um, but I, but I know some Oregon supporters. So what do you guys think, Oregon or Kamal? Do you support the Turkish presidential election results? Anyway, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next political episode.